Top 10 Best Ideas on How to Survive Wild Animal Attacks One of the fun activities with family and friends every summer is camping or hiking a mountain because you enjoy bonding with your family far from the pollution of the cities. But you're not the only living creature in the jungle or in the mountains because the animals living there can be disturbed because of the noise from you and the outdoor activities you do. What will you do to escape when wild animals attack you while you're camping? Hello guys! Welcome back to our YouTube channel. How are you? I hope you're okay in your home. If you were bored and have plans to hike or camp with family and friends when summer arrives, then this episode is right for you. It is one of the safety measures you will need to know in case you will be attacked by wild animals while you're there. Because animals are different and their nature is different in how they attack their opponents. I will show you how to survive wild animal attacks with 10 different animals found in the wild. Number 1. A Wolf Attack One of the scariest animals you can encounter in the wild are wolves because sometimes they do not attack alone. They often attack with their pack. Normally they don't really hurt people, just don't try to hurt their pups because you definitely can't survive their attacks. But if you have been attacked by a wolf, you must stay in your place and intimidate him so he will know that you will not allow him to beat you. Do not run, because he will surely run after you. Slowly move away from him, but be alert on his actions as he may suddenly catch you. If the wolf is still trying to harm you, scream at him as loud as you can to intimidate him and fight against him as you try to save yourself. Number 2. A Crocodile Attack when you put your tents near the bodies of water in a forest, inevitably there is a crocodile living there that can attack you. When a crocodile attacks you while you are fishing or swimming, swim to the shore as fast as you can to save your life. The crocodile's target is to drown you and eat you when you're dead. So if there's no way to get away from you, then fight him to the best of your ability. Try to hurt his nose and eyes as this is the most sensitive part of their body. When he loses his attention to you, immediately leave the water to save yourself. Number 3. A Moose Attack Wild moose are known for being wild animals that do not normally hurt humans. Just don't try to hurt them. But when they are too hungry, they see anything including humans as their prey. So in case you encounter a moose, give them a lot of space and immediately change your direction so you can't meet him. But if he chases you, then run for your life! Climb to the nearest tree if you can, so they won't reach you. If he catches you and hurts you, roll yourself down and protect your head. Because if he lasts and he doesn't knock you down, he will leave. Number 4. A Chimpanzee Attack When you see chimpanzees in the jungle, don't go crazy. Try to act as cool as you can and show that he has no effect on you and that you are not afraid of him. Don't try to throw him a stone because you can only increase his annoyance. Go slowly and don't look at them in the eyes. But if they attack to harm you, then do everything you can to save yourself. Number 5. Tiger Attack When we see a tiger, they are often in the zoo and are confined, so we're not really scared at all. But what if you meet them in the middle of the jungle where you can find no help? What will you do? When a tiger is right in front of you, stand straight and chest out to look bigger. When you get close to a tree, climb on top of it. Because when a tiger sees that you're bigger than him and there's a big chance he won't reach you, then you can also wave your hand in the air to act bigger. Number 6. A bear attack. Bears are terrifying because they are big and they have sharp nails. As much as possible, try to avoid bears when you see them. Do not insist on getting pictures for it to show off to your friends. Just think of ways on how to save your life from a disaster you can face. Once you're attacked by bears and you have no idea but to deal with them, stop, be calm, and find a way to get out of that place. Wave your hands at the top of your head to look bigger and for them to fear you. You can even produce loud noises to direct their attention to others and save yourself. It is best to get out safely because you don't know how much damage a bear can do to you when they attack you. Number 7. Cougars The cougars are also known as mountain lions. Unlike other animals that when you encounter them, the rule is not to make eye contact. But change it with cougars. Maintain eye contact and stand tall to appear bigger. When they attack you, fight back aggressively. 
You can shout, wave your arms, and throw rocks at them so they can retreat from attacking you. With these things, you can save yourself from the risk of death the cougars can inflict on you. Number 8. A snake attack. Snakes don't really hurt people. They just use their snake bites to defend them from harm. When you see a snake, just let it do its work and don't go near it. But if you suddenly get bitten by it, all you can do is to prevent the spread of venom from your body until you get to the nearest anti-venom hospital. As much as possible, put the part that is bitten lower than your heart. Keep the person awake for a longer spread of venom. Tighten any fabric on both sides of the bitten part as this will slow down the spread of venom. Immediately call for help and send a victim to the nearest hospital. Number 9. A Deer Attack When you see a deer, do not ignore it because it has a greater chance of running after you. Meet him and make a way for you to look greater and bigger in his eyes. Slowly climb a tree if there is one near you so you won't be caught. But if he attacks you, protect your head, neck, and body parts that can be damaged when he attacks you. Just do it until he has left you. Number 10. Bees attack. When you see a beehive in the forest, the number one rule is that you do not touch it. Because when the bees come out of here, you can't do anything but scream and even run to save yourself from their venomous bites. All animals have their own defense mechanism to protect themselves. So if you don't want them to hurt you, don't do the things that will hurt them. That's all for today. I hope you have learned a lot about how to avoid and survive wildlife attacks when you encounter one during camping or hiking. Thank you for watching! Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and turn on the notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a video like this. Keep safe everyone!